This video, I'll show you how to set any song as your iPhone ringtone. There's no easy way to do this, but this method only requires your iPhone and nothing else. First, you need a song, obviously. There are many different ways to download a song as an MP3 file, but if you don't know the ways, at the very end of this video, I'll show you how to do a screen recording of a song and then convert it to an audio file to use as a ringtone. So skip to the end if you don't already have a song inside of your files app. Now, if you do have a song, first thing you'll need to do to set it as your iPhone ringtone is to open GarageBand. If you don't have it, go to the App Store and download it. It's from Apple and it's free. Next, open it. Scroll to Audio Recorder. Tap Voice. Then click on this Illuminati icon and then on the brick icon over here. Then click the little plus at the top and choose Automatic. Next, click the loop icon, go to Files, and here's where you're going to import your song. Find it wherever you saved it inside of the Files app, and then hold it and drag it to import it into GarageBand. Now here you can tap on the song and adjust its length if you want to, but make sure you drag it back to the beginning so it doesn't start off with silence. Next, click the upside down triangle on the top left, choose My Songs, tap and hold on the song that you made, click Share and choose Ringtone. Now pick a name for your ringtone and export. Next, go into your settings, sound and haptics, ringtone, and if I scroll up, there it is. Now, if you don't already have a song on your iPhone, you can do a screen recording and then convert it to an MP3 audio file. So first, record a song that you want. If you don't see the recording icon when you swipe down, go to Settings, Control Center and click plus next to Screen Recording. Now, once you swipe down and click this, it will record. So do that. Then open up the Shortcuts app. If you don't have it, download it from the App Store. It's from Apple and it's free. Click the plus sign and then rename your shortcut to something like, well, whatever you want. Then click the Info menu here at the bottom and press Show in Share Sheet. Click on Receive, click Clear and choose Media. Next, you'll want to click Add Action and search for Encode Media, and then click on it. Next, click the little arrow here and select Audio Only. Press Search at the bottom and look for Save File, and press Done. And that's it. Now go to your Photos app where you made the screen recording, press Share, and click on the shortcut name that you created before. Then click Browse and choose a location where you want to save it. I'll choose Downloads, but you can pick whatever location you want. And finally, Open. That's it, you'll have the audio file in your Files app. You can now go through the same process with the GarageBand that I showed you before to set it as your ringtone. Next time, if you want to convert your screen recording into a song, you don't have to create a new shortcut, obviously. Just click Share and it'll be there. So yeah, drop a like if this was useful.